In this video, I'm going to explain how to create try data label chart. Mean it will display the actual value, the actual difference, and the percentage difference. Consider I have this data sheet on which I have the monthly actual total sale along with the target. Now, of course, you can build this chart for comparing two air sale. For example, if you have the previous air sale and current air sale, you can use this chart to compare the sale as well. The first thing we need to build few helper column. The first helper column will be top series and I will just write zero here and simply drag this one. Next, we need to calculate person to target. So I will simply write the header person to target and I will apply a very simple formula equal open parenthesis actual value minus target close parenthesis divide by monthly target and simply hit enter and now i will simply convert this into percentage and drag this formula down next we need to calculate the actual difference so i will simply write actual difference simply type equal and now i need to select actual sale first minus monthly target and simply hit enter drag this formula down Next, I need to create a column for outside data label mean the actual value. So I will simply write outside data label and I will simply click equal and reference column B and simply hit enter, drag this formula down. Now I will apply custom number formatting on outside data label. I will select column G video, click on number formatting, click on custom, remove everything and simply type dollar $0.0. .0 and simply type one comma which is for thousand on the very end simply type k which means these value are in thousand and simply hit ok the next thing we need to create column for inside data label so i will simply call inside data label now here i will apply a very simple function simply type equal text open parenthesis select the percent column hit comma and for the format quotation mark zero percent Quotation mark again, close parenthesis, hit enter. Now this will give us the same result, but now this is the text, not a number. The next thing I will simply write and person quotation mark space pipe symbol space again quotation mark and end percent. And now I need to apply again the text function open parenthesis. Select the actual difference f2 hit comma and for the format in this case i want the thousand format dollar zero hit comma and simply type k quotation mark close parenthesis hit enter and now i will simply drag this formula now our calculation are ready the first thing i need to select column a and column b hold control key and select column d as well simply click on insert recommended chart Select all chart and here I will select stake column chart and simply hit enter. The next thing I will move this chart a little bit to the bottom area and increase the width of this chart. In this case, I will delete the legend. I will also delete the chart title for now and also delete the vertical axis. Right click on any of the column format data series. In this case, I will choose gap width, let's say 20%. The next thing we need to apply data label. If I simply click on format on the very left side, you can see a drop down menu. The first thing I will select top series and now I will simply click on plus I can click on data label. And here you can see zero zero data label. I will click more data label options. Select data label and here I will simply check value from sale. In this case, I will select outside data label. Simply hit OK and uncheck the actual value also show leader line. The next thing I will make it inside base and now you can see our data label perfectly display on my chart. The next thing we need to apply inside data label. So for this I will click again on format and here I will select total sale. Again click on plus apply data label. Click on more data label option. Select label option value from sale and in this case i will select inside data label simply hit ok and also uncheck value and show leader line in this case i will select inside end 
now i need to do a little bit more formatting for now i will close this format data label the first thing we need to change the color of total cell column i will click on any of the column click on format for the shape fill i will select this darkest color now select the data label simply decrease the font size a little bit more you can increase the column weight a little bit more as well click on this data label click on format and for the shape fill in this case i will select this light color i think better we need to delete the grid lines so simply click on plus and uncheck grid line the next thing i will simply click outside data label and i will assign the dark black color you can choose any of the color and also increase the size a little bit more the next thing if you click on format and simply select plot area we need to decrease this plot area a little bit more so that our upper data label look perfect let's say instead of this pipe symbol you want a line break here simply click on inside data label and instead of double quotation mark pipe symbol simply remove everything here and write a very simple function character open parenthesis 10 close parenthesis hit enter and simply drag this formula character 10 will actually insert a new line now look at the graph person and actual difference are in different line if you want to increase the space a little bit more simply apply one more character 10 and person character 10 close parenthesis hit enter and drag this formula down now you can see our space a little bit more and this will make our chart much more easy for the reader. I hope you learned something useful and enjoyed this video. I will share this template with you. If you have any specific question, just write me comment. Thank you so much.